Hello everybody and welcome back to Coral Island where today I am very very interested in getting a few things up and running um, to do with... Uh, I'll do my harvesting first. I'll do my normal morning chores. But what I'm most interested in doing today... Oh my beets are ready, wonderful. No room for any of them though. Let's have a look and see if there's anything that I can sell in my inventory. Uh, oh, I picked up a whole load of stuff at that. Uh, ha uh, was it the Harvest Festival? I think it might have been. So we picked up a couple of like seedlings, saplings. Um, I've got a sword. Do you know, I should probably just sell that, right? If I can. Can I? No, apparently not. Okay, so we can definitely sell the ground beetle. I'm almost certain. I have to check. I have to check. Yeah, it has been donated, so I can sell that. I can put some bits away. I'm kind of thinking that um, one thing that I, I sort of want to do with my computer. I want to put it down and have a little go with it because I'm, I'm desperate to see what it does. So, yeah, where is it from? Let's rotate it. I don't always think. What is rotate again? I've forgotten how to rotate things, or can I? Maybe I can't even rotate things. Let's uh, let's have a look anyway. Let's interact with it. So interact with the sturdy computer. I've got the online shop here, where I can buy. Any kind of seed. Any kind of fall seed by the look of it. Okay. So I don't have to go to Sam's shop anymore. All the seedlings, all the saplings. Cocoa, jackfruit. Pear. Oh, nice. Okay. Fertilizer on grass. Uh, the pet shop. I can buy anything from the pet shop. Wow. Anything from Jack's Ranch, except for the animals, so it's only the actual shops. The Beet Shack's shop, I can buy a sardine, a coconut drink, grilled fish, and all the bait. I can buy oars, and kelp, and glass. Aquarium calendar. Woodstone, the tavern, I can buy all the meals from, I expect. Raj's coffee, I can buy all of the bits and bobs, the cocoa, the various coffees. Gesher coffee, I think, comes from the Gesher coffee beans, and I think that comes from the uh, B rank animals. And then I've got all of the... Now, this is where it's getting interesting. I can see all of the things from the... Uh, white flamingo store so all the cute little outfits which I will start to be partaking in very very soon this is a whole new it's like a whole new world right now whole new world um, wow that's pretty blouse summer maiden top wow there's some nice stuff hoodies Boots and shoes. There's like wedding dresses. <laughs> I think the enchanted one looks nicer. Sky dragon wings. What? Oh, some lovely stuff here. Okay. Then we've got the indoor uh, furniture and the outdoor decor. So there's all sorts of different furniture you can get. Wow, I think it, that might be the entire furniture catalogue opened up there. So we could definitely do some really nice decorating with this. I don't know whether we've got any kind of like wallpapers or flooring, so. <gasps> wow, look at the fireplaces. 
That would look nicer than my stupid fireplace I have right now. Wow. Mermaid wardrobe. Mermaid chest dress. Oh, wow. That's so nice. A piano. Okay, I'm going to be spending a lot of money in here. Definitely. And then we've got outdoor decor. So we've got all the... The bushes and trees, flower pots. Yeah, I'm gonna be probably very much stone pebble floor tiles, regal stone path, art nouveau fences. Hmm. I think I might be uh, possibly changing up my pathing because these are gorgeous. A grass floor tile. What have I been saying for ages? That I've wanted like grass to go... I'm gonna spend like a thousand on that. It'll be delivered to my mail, so it should be in my mailbox. Does it get it straight away? Nice! Look, I've got 10 grass tiles here. I've been looking for this for ages because I've wanted to put it like around by the beehives here. I wanted to have like proper nice grass underneath the beehives. Look! Oh, my farm is going to look so much better now I can have that. Oh, okay. Let's pick up these beets, I guess. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. Uh, my batteries need to go back in there. So that'll help me pick up some more of the beets as well. Then I'd better go... Oh, man. Scavenger balls? I could maybe put the trumpet things away i don't know i can't fit anything in there <laughs> nightmare oh and one thing i need to do actually one thing will give me an inventory space as well i think that apple pie that i got as a reward can go straight to the goddess i don't think i had time last night but i think that's one of the like advanced rare cooking things yes well that's all right isn't it I don't need to work out how to do apple pie now. Perfect. Oh, so much stuff I can't do. But that rare altar, that's all stuff I can't do. The catch altar is all stuff I can't do. One thing I can do though is to try and get the bat wings. So that might be a thing to try and do today. Uh, but what I really need as well is the R&D. I need the R&D for the um, upgrades. And I just need to remind myself of exactly what I need for that. I think I wrote it down, but I think I also probably lost it somewhere. It's been a while since I recorded that one, see. So. I just remind myself, I think it's something like five batteries, five grand worth of money. Ultimate scarecrow. <laughs> Sorry, I have to say it like that. So, um, auto trash collectors and things like that, auto feeders, like automating things is really, really cool. But I think what I want to do is this line first. Um, and particularly the catching component and the fishing component, probably more than anything, the, the fishing component. I've been keeping my water essences and things for a while, so I finally actually get to use them for something. 10 gold ore, 10 osmium ore, and 5 batteries. Okay, so... Really, Osmium or Gold or Water Essence. I'd forgotten about that. But they're all things I have. What I don't have is enough batteries. So, I think what we want to be doing, once I've... Uh, I'll let my, let my animals outside first, actually. Once I've let my animals outside, and then we go and put everything into the... Uh, I, am, I, I am unreasonably happy with this like awesome like grass, brock grass. <laughs> I'm gonna buy so much of that. It looks so nice. Oh man, oh yeah. Let's just go in. Let's go into the shed. But the nice thing is I'm getting to a point now where the, I can probably start to slow down on the amount of uh, Away. Oh, finally a bit of room. Do I have tarot in this one? Yes. 
Um, yeah, I'm finally getting to... Oh. <laughs> Let me talk first. I'm finally getting to the point where I'm not going to need necessarily to constantly be... I'm going to make more money uh, than I really need to use all the time. So that's going to be quite good. So we've got some aged coffee there and I think we might have some mead to pick up there. No, not quite yet. Okay, fine. And then we've got normal coffee over here. Keeping coffee around is a really good idea because um, coffee really did a good job at getting me some extra points with people at that last Harvest Festival. Uh, now I've done the Harvest Festival, I can just... Until next year, anyway. Until next spring, I'll start uh, putting stuff away for the Harvest Festival. But for now, I can just make mayonnaise out of it all and stuff. Did I have any other quail eggs? I did. I got three um, nice quail eggs, so I can make three quail egg mayonnaises today. I've got a load of uh, golden eggs. I've also got three duck eggs. Let's go through the duck eggs and the quail eggs first. And then I'll start slowly processing through the golden eggs. And then we've got some cheese wheels and milk and stuff. I can make more aging barrels. Um, that will come slowly over time. I'm not going to spend like ages every day doing that. But what I will need is glass. Okay, so now I've picked everything up from here and I've just started everything off and all that. I'm, I'm going to run around sort of putting things away, etc, etc. Uh, scrap needs to go in there. Is that really all the scrap I have at the moment? If it is, I need to go and um, make some trash into scrap. Because I'm going to need more than that. I'm going to need to start collecting glass now, see. So. Alright. So what I would say now is... Uh, any glass. How much glass do I have? Um, is, it, is it really? Do I really have none? Like, really, really? Do I have none? Anywhere? Did I put it somewhere? Um, but what I'm going to need to make is this little thing here. Actually, I'll see in my crafting menu. <coughs> Excuse me. Swallowed the wrong way there. Uh, so, I want to make one of these guys. I apparently do have enough. I just need two gold bars. All right, then. That's easy. I can do that. I've got enough stuff for that. And then we're going to start collecting batteries. And we're going to start then getting the components that I need. Let's put that back away in there. In there. I need to sort out my scavenger balls chest a little bit as well. I think there's going to be some duplicates in there that I don't need. I'm just going to want to keep one of everything and maybe just sell the rest off. I'm getting a little bit annoyed with how much stuff is around and things, so... Yeah, uh, okay, so scavenger balls. Like, I don't need to have four million different types of ginseng, for example. So, although well, someone did say I could try putting ginseng or ginger into the, but maybe not so many mushrooms. Maybe I'll take away some of the lower ranked mushrooms and I'll take away maybe that. Um, Do I need to do? I want to keep the blank black trumpet mushroom. I'll keep the osmium one and I'll sell the four other ones. I think that might be a bit better. And also then there's um, pansies that need to be moved into the flower chest and I can make those into bee box things. But as always, I've got a hundred million things to do every episode. So I won't necessarily be able to get around to all of it. Sell the apple jam, sell the cheese wheels. Still got milk in there that needs to go. Get all the mayonnaise is gone. I'll uh, put my pear seedling into the greenhouse. I 
I'm slowly going through and getting all of those. My lemons are ready today. Lovely. How come there's like, is there a gap between? Oh yeah, there's purposely a gap, isn't there? Because I have to. I will probably eventually just redo this entire thing, but we'll stick the pear there. And that'll get watered in, in the morning. I'm in no particular rush for pears to be done. But it kind of completes the row, doesn't it? We've also got a second apple sapling, which probably won't end up being uh, a thing until next year. But we'll pop it down and let it grow. Getting there slowly with those as well. I uh, got some apples to get today, if it will let me. Let me. Well, let me shake it. Hmm. Maybe it's tomorrow. Maybe they're not ready yet or something. I don't care enough to try and see why that's a problem. <laughs> like, I really don't. Um... What else can I do? I could mill a bit of salt, maybe. I was going to stick a tree tap. Uh, we've got that tree tap that we got. We've got so much stuff from the Harvest Festival, basically, that's just left over that I haven't dealt with yet. But I'm thinking I could just tree tap this tree here. Okay. And that will give me some resin. And I need resin to do some of my upgrades. In the meantime, I'm going to cut a few trees around here as well. They kind of need to be done manually, these ones, because... But I don't really want any trees here that aren't tapped trees. And I honestly, I'm not exactly going to sit there trying to make money off the tree taps. Either. Early game, that would have been fine, but right now I've got way better options making money, so... Then I could just like start working on maybe landscaping all of this. I could maybe cover this in nice grass or something and then put nice decorations around and stuff and stop it looking like a big brown mess. I just like the whole thing just like mud right now. And if I was going to put trees in, I'd put like nice fruit trees or something or I'd sort of put something nice and decorative in rather than just these rubbish trees. So. That's what we're going to do. That, there we are. That's the final bits of trees, I think, anyway. Well, maybe these ones. Obviously, these ones are my fruit trees. And then you've got these ones at the back here as well. I'm not too worried about them right now. I'll show a little bit of a tidy of these logs. Okay. So I want to go make some cheese wheels out of my milk. I haven't even milked the cows today, have I? Did I even let them outside? I didn't even... Get... Look, it's half past five and I didn't even get to the animals yet. Gee, this game, I swear. But it's because my inventory was so chockers with everything. So, that is why. So, you guys need some hay, don't you? Let's put some hay in for you. I want to pet you. The auto petter will probably one of the, be one of the first things I get <laughs> when it comes to automating things. I don't even want to automate my crops that much. I wanted to go look for bat wings today. That's not going to happen, is it? Goodness me. Large osmium awesome milk. Let's feed them all. Because, like I say, they're not uh, not been let outside today, which is pretty bad for them. And we'll also our pet uh, Penelope the pig. Lovely. Right, so that was a bit of a nothing day, wasn't it? If we had a rainy day, I will try again to get that Arapaima fish. I don't know if there's a good time of day for it or what. So it might be a nighttime thing. Not certain, but... It's all good. So we'll 
Oh, I've got my stamina fruit to eat as well. Haven't done that either. So that will get me from 747 up to somewhere near to 800, I think. Yeah. Very nice indeed. Um, yeah, so I've got eggs and milk and, and things to sell. All right, so let's sell that, the maple syrup. Let's sell the... Um, Keep the coffees for presents. For some reason, the sap wasn't going into the building mats chest. Oh, no, it was. Okay. Scavenger balls chest. Oh, we wanted to sell the moral mushroom, didn't we? Sorry. Getting through it. Getting through it now. Uh, then food. Uh, in, oh, I'll put that in the fridge at the end of the day, actually. And let's go and sort a few things out. Feeling very excited about how the farm's going to look now I've got things available. I, they probably always were if I went to the shop, but once they're right in front of your face, it's so much easier, isn't it? That computer's amazing. And that's before I even do the catch altars and stuff. Right, I no, look, I've got enough to make my solar panel now. Right, let's do it. I've had enough before, but I've never, just never done it. So I'll put that outside. Um, looks like the quail eggs are done, so I can put another one in there. That gets rid of that. I had a couple of milks to make cheese with as well. Is that the only milk I had? No, there was another one. I thought I had another one. Goat cheese. Are they both goat cheese? Oh, that's really super annoying. I shouldn't have done that, should I? Oh, well. Tomorrow, I guess. Um, I can put some coffee on as well. Got some Osmium coffee beans there. I'm massively struggling for time, so I'm not going to do too much in here today. Right, let's go and put my solar panel down uh, next to the computer. I'm still a bit upset that I don't have, I don't know how to rotate things anymore. Like, when did I forget how to do that? Or were you ever able to rotate things on the farm? I don't know, but maybe this should be inside. This should definitely be outside. probably have a bank of them eventually so that's that's just slowly going to be making batteries for me but I think the computer might be better off inside my house somewhere so let's do that I mean maybe eventually I'll have a study area or something but uh, inside the house I think you can rotate things so if I press P there Decorate. Got a bunch of paintings, look. It won't let me... It won't let me do anything with these paintings? Why not? That's weird. How odd is that? It won't let me do anything with the computer either, though, apparently, so... I'll stick it in next to the fireplace in the fridge. So that's where I go to look at stuff. Uh, and eventually, once I get five batteries, we'll be all good for that. So it's time to go to sleep now. I sold a few things, but not a ton. So I've got 45 stamina for my stamina fruit. 50. I didn't sell a ton of stuff, but I sold like 8,000 worth truffle oils. <laughs> yes, well... Thank you, Penelope. You made all the money that day. Or nearly, nearly half of it came from Penelope. So. What are we going to do today? I've got Osmium Kelp Essence. That I was supposed to be bringing down. Um, do I have any more than that? 
I was supposed to be bringing that down under the sea. I've got one battery out. I think I already had two in here. So we're up to three. So I should be able to probably tomorrow or something get the next bit. But yeah, it's a lot easier to... Oh, fridge. She lab fridge. If you're going to keep cooked food in the fridge, go to the fridge. Because it's absolutely impossible. Otherwise, it's all those people saying like, you should have sold your hammer, she lab. Actually, I don't think we can sell these um, weapons that we find. I'm going to sell those, so... Those can be processed. I may even sell that corn, like, I've got so much. And the situation is only going to get worse. <laughs> I think my storage system is at, the, at this point robust, robust enough to cope with it. But I am wondering whether I should be selling all my sweet potatoes and things like that. Probably should, because you know what? I can't do anything with it. At least I know I can process pickles, uh, process eggplants and cranberries. But sweet potatoes, no. And I've got loads in the fridge as well. It's not like I, if I suddenly need a sweet potato, it's going to be a problem. Some gourmet salt. Let's let the animals out today. Oh, this is so much better, isn't it? I just, everything was just a bit of a mess after that harvest festival. I just needed a day to sort it all out, didn't I? That was all it was. head in here I'll grab anything that needs to be sold and then I will go and deal with, uh, then I'll go sell it and then I'll go deal with my pets I will stick so it would be good to have a second battery maker I think just for all of the things that need batteries um, so I will stick some of this straight into the furnace we make some glass. And then I think I will take some trash processing. I will actually do that today and I will actually process some of my veggies and things today as well. And then we'll go see what the animals have got in store. And then let's see how I'm doing for that Osmium Essence. Like, what's going on with that then? I've got loads of it. Okay. Got nine of it. So I think I'll go and take it under the sea. I'm just going to chuck those cranberries straight into the um, mason jars. I'm trying to get through everything. Mason jars are always less. There's always you always get less for them, but it's still it's still good to do, and it's probably better to have the money earlier than later. And then we'll do some pickled eggplants. Right, so the remains of that can just sort of be put away, and then. I go sell a few things. Oh, the milks and the eggs still needs doing. Okay. Well, let's have a look at uh, exactly what the situation is here. We've got a lot of large golden chicken eggs. So I'm going to get two of those uh, sorted today then. And I don't think that I, with the, especially with golden eggs, that I have enough mayonnaise makers right now. So one thing I'm going to do is just uh, take that cheese press up. And move it back over here so there's room. Come on, there you go. And then I'm going to see if we can make another mayonnaise maker. I definitely have the recipe for it. Uh, mayonnaise machine, I need one bronze. Of course I do. Of course it couldn't just be like something I could make straight away. Of course I'm missing something for it. Oh, I don't even have any bronze at all. Okay, so that'll get left for a bit later. Oh, I've still got milk. Okay. 
<laughs> right, let's go pet uh, the peacock and the pig. And there's another white truffle. You're doing a good job. Such a good job. Well done. And now we've got a goat milk. And cow milk. And a peacock feather today as well. Well done. Phoenix. Oh, wow. That... That relationship is going up, because considering the amount of effort I'm putting into the, the relationship, it's going up very fast. And I genuinely think that that's more to do with, like, their hate is amazing. And they love it. Now, let's make some nice cheese. Oh, in fact, I could age these cheese wheels. These two Osmium goat cheese wheels would, uh, would probably really enjoy. Oh, no. I can't age them. Okay, that's fine. I'll keep them for aging, I think, because they're going to make a lot more money if they are aged. Uh, but we'll make the goat, the make the milk into cheese. Go sell all the rest of the stuff. See if I've got another battery yet. Because what I'm desperate for is like I think the fishing catch and then the then the bug catch. They only produce a certain amount of batteries. Can I buy batteries? Those paintings, I want to see if I can put them down as well. Um, so we've got this. Whatever it is. What is it? I'm not certain what that is. It looks weird. Um, but I'll see if I can put the paintings up from my inventory because I couldn't put them up from the painting thing. Is there a way? Decorate. Decor mode. But they seem to think that they're floor tiles. Like, I have no idea what the deal is with those. That's so weird. I might just sell them or something. Can I sell it? I can't do anything with them. They're only decorative as well. Uh, the wool needs dealing with, the truffle needs dealing with. That to me looks like it might be struggling somehow. So I may do a quick relog tomorrow. If I come outside and it still looks like I can't pick the battery up from it, then I'll I'll take a look. But okay, let's go and sort out all the other stuff that needs to be done. And then I want to go and see, uh, I want to go to the mines and see about bat wings. That's the one thing for the altar that I can do at the moment, but I haven't done yet. So there's one large... Is that a goat milk? Yeah. Put that in there. Wool in there. Truffle oil there. Got five glass there. I think for another solar panel, I need like 20 glass. So let's have a look. Uh, yeah, I'm just missing a little bit though. So if I take a little bit of scrap and make that into glass, then we should be able to make a second one. And this is how it's going to be. I'm going to be just slowly but surely Slowly but surely increasing things. And uh, that, that's basically what the second year is for, in my opinion. It's like catching as much stuff at the catch altars and stuff as you can. 
but also for just expanding the farm to a really profitable state. And then year three is for like socializing and decorating. Although I don't know how much of the socializing and decorating I want to do in this run because I'm going to be honest, some some of the things I've heard about like marriage and things like that have, made, have put me off maybe doing that right now. But the other thing is I don't know whether I want to just finish the run of Coral Island and then move. I'm going to be moving on to other games. So it's it's very, very common for me not to want to come back to something once all these other games are coming out. So I really am in a bit of a bind as to what to do on that one. Uh, why am I here? That wasn't where I wanted to be. I was actually wanting to head to the Merfolk Kingdom. With with my... Oh, please tell me I actually did bring my Osmium. Yes, I did. Lovely. Right, so we're off to see the Oracle. Yeah, you thought I'd forgotten about that, didn't you? But I hadn't. I just really needed to sort my life out for a little bit. The Harvest Festival was very exciting and I won it and I got loads of points. And it was amazing. Hello, good you're here. Let's see what you've brought. Excellent. These are just right. There's a harmony in these ingredients. I don't even know what I bought for her, to be honest. But wait, there's something missing. Of course, the riddle. In a dance of colours it stands tall, neither plant nor creature, but a bit of both. Its sap gives life and binds them all. Neither plant nor creature. Oh, it's probably coral, isn't it? Is it the coral tree? Precisely. The coral tree. We need a sap. Am I going to have to tap the coral tree now? Let's go, Shelab. The coral tree awaits. By the powers of the sea and the balance of the tide, gift us your essence, oh coral tree, to bridge land at ocean wide. This is super exciting. Okay, we have coral tree sap. The potion is complete. She lab now quickly. We must hurry back to Cho Oyo's chamber. Is she talking about herself in the third person? Brace yourself, She lab. May the ocean welcome you with open arms. Okay, here we go. Bye bye, diving suit, I think. can choose oh wow you get like legs with webbed feet or you can have a tail can you see what's missing from here yes that's right there's no pub no purple tail not a single purple tail I kind of like the legs, actually. <laughs> kind of fun. So if there's a lack of purple, what I need to do is find what goes with purple the best. I think it's the range of blues and pinks. The I think the teal with the pink actually looks quite nice. I also think the pink and the pink looks quite nice. And I also think... No, I, I'm not into the gold one. And I'm not really into the shark tails either. And I do think I want a proper tail. So I think it's between 
these two. And I think I'm slightly more liking the blue. So there we are. Cute blue and pink mermaid tail. I'm going to have to get a better bikini top though, aren't I? Do you like it? Yes. I look so good! Yes, you do. You make a fine merfolk, she lab. Who would have thought? Now go. The ocean beckons you to explore it in your new form. You're one of us now. Cool. Let's go swimming. The merfolk have bestowed their blessing upon you, embracing you as one of their own. I'm diving. So that's one of the journal thing. That's one of the things... I didn't get that reward, apparently. Okay, so... If I look in my journal, I can now see that's um, another one of the specials. So, being in the Band of Smiles is a special, although I've not been able to do much with it since. Something from the Harvest Goddess. Something from the Giants, I think. Um, like the brush from the museum. But there's still another four to go, so I don't know what they would be. Oh, I go so fast now! And I have, and I have a d what? Someone was saying I have a dash, but I didn't realize I go this quickly. Oh my goodness, that is so cool. Oh, I am gonna love cleaning up the ocean so much more in this state. It's going to be so much easier. I know I said that once I'd done all my farm chores that I'd go in... Yeah, that I would go in... Uh... Tattoos? Hmm. Yeah, I, I, I know I said that once I'd done all my farm chores I would go and... Uh try and find the bat wings but maybe we could do that tomorrow because what I want to do right now is go and clean the whole sea because oh my goodness is that easier my new speed boost amazing I'll get the whole thing just cleared that's <laughs> taxing my computer a bit more actually as well it's gonna be so good Love this. <gasps> Another coffer. So, yeah, I do need to get coffers. have the whole ocean cleaned up in about two seconds and I've got 800 stamina now as well like how much easier is everything now I don't think I need bronze kelp for anything now so I'll probably just sell that or make it into essence and sell the essence although at the moment I'm needing the glass so Da, 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 da. Sea slug. Have the whole bronze layer like done in about ten minutes flat now.
Okay. I'm loving this so much. So one of the, the things, the final things I think I am going to do, I've got one of every type of animal, which is really nice. Um, and I don't really think I'm particularly looking to get a ton more. I might do, but one thing I really do want to get is a horse. So I think I've now been all around here and I've done all of that area and we're only at half past nine so that's actually pretty amazing so what we're not gonna get if I get if I can just come down here and do this every so often uh, is wanting to come down and get some essences, get some kelp, and everything is just covered in trash. I didn't really make a big effort to clean my inventory out before I came down here. I didn't really know what I was going to be doing down here, so normally I would. You know, certain hot spots hide the best loot. Yes, so that's that's that area done in like ten seconds. The sea will never be bad again. Sorry, you just have no idea how much more fun this is. It's one of these weird things, isn't it? The game is fun now I've, pl I've played most of it. But I think that's nice though. When you get a reward, it's like, well, you've done all the, the rubbish bits. You've done all the you've done the hard work, now you get to just play. So yeah, I've basically cleared all of that in like half an evening. Which is actually pretty cool. Yeah, it does look like it might only produce like five batteries per solar panel or something like that. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen with that. I'll have a look tomorrow morning and see, but I'm, I'm thinking I might need several more of those. Oh, that was so fun though. Like just dashing around the ocean. 12,000 somehow. How? how even so I think today what I want to do is actually I feel like I might want to do a little bit of fishing at some point actually I'm going to get everything into the dehydrator because I've got a lot of things to harvest today but I do want to make some sashimi because I know that Raphael really likes it and I want to start trying to get to know him a bit better Everybody else, I'm happy with just like, yeah, give them coffee at festivals, that sort of thing. It's all very fine. That's all good. Right, so I do need the dehydrator. Well, I did find a lot of stuff under the sea. I feel like some of my stuff is getting stuck. And that might be holding me up with some of my things. Hmm. 
Are my barrels stuck? No, they're not stuck. They're still working on stuff. But is that truffle oil? I think the oil press might be stuck. So the question is, do I restart and just see if things are stuck or not? I don't know. Maybe I'll play one more day and just see how it goes. Because at the end of this episode, I'm going to be reloading anyway, so it's fine. Um, put the honey, I'm just going to put some of the stuff that I took out of that. Oh no, it's still working fine. That's good. That's good. If the truffle oil is stuck, then that's fine. I'm not worried about that. Um, just going to check that none of the ocean critters are ones that haven't been put into the museum yet. I very much doubt anything on the bronze layer will not have been put in already, but just on the off chance. So I will sell all of my cheese, mayonnaise, stuff like that today. We don't know how much Osmium Blue Dahlia honey goes for. Interesting. Uh, make coffers, gold bars, la 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 la. So I've got loads of loads of building materials that I found under the sea. Loads of stuff for the sea chest. The coffees are just stacking, to be honest. Like all, all the coffee seems to be osmium all the time for some reason. Um, but I can keep that for presents. That's not a problem. Uh, donations. I want to put the coffers in. Why am I in the scavenger balls chest? No. Donations. Lovely. Oh yeah, my fuchsia flatworm. So today I will go into the mines because I did say I would. I'm just going to put the salt into the milling chest and then we'll grab all of, uh, let the animals out as well even if I just let them out and don't go and collect all the eggs and things first thing in the morning but I think maybe I should maybe I should do that before I do anything oh man they've got more eggs so many eggs But it's just the cow's milk today. Ah, that's all right. Just about keeping up with the milk, but I am not keeping up with the eggs at all. So when I go to the mines, I'll see if I can get a bit of bronze together. And if I can, then we can use that. I do have some inventory space. I don't know whether it'll be quite enough for all the stuff we have to harvest today, because it's a lot. We've got artichokes, taro, and amaranth to go today. I think I will sell the taro today. Just because I, I get overwhelmed with it otherwise. It's just too much, isn't it? Now one taro root <laughs> didn't have a star on it. Lovely. Thank you. Good stuff. And I will have seeds come the winter this time, which is nice, because we are at a C rank. I would love to be at a B rank, but, uh, and I'm so close. <laughs> but I really do need to get things into the museum and into the altar. So the museum is most behind. And I just need those computer chips. I really do need to go and have a check as well. One thing I really do want to check. Okay, right, we've got to plan this right. One thing I do want to check is uh, what I can spend my merit points on. I need to know about that a bit more. So those cheese wheels are for aging things. I think the coffee might be done. No, it's not. Orchid mead is done. The coffee's... No, they are done. Okay, I can get the cheese wheels in now. Lovely. Age those for me, please. I'll be making some more aging barrels eventually as well, but again, it's just... 
time. We want to make some pickled artichokes today. Yeah, I'm going to pickle some artichokes, I decided. Lovely. Yeah, there's still some left, so I need to find where I'm keeping the artichokes, if anywhere. In here, apparently. And the amaranth is in the milling chest. Then I've got all of these, <laughs> all of these eggs. So many eggs. Can't even do anything with all these eggs. There's too many of them. And then I've got stuff to put in the sea chest as well. For some reason, I never quite managed to upgrade from this. Yeah. Um, am I keeping salt in here? No, salt's going in the milling chest now, isn't it, with the amaranth? So, and then those are being sold. That's for gifts. I'll put the scrap and the gold bars away. Other than that, I think everything is good in here. Oh, unless I want to make a bit more coffee. Yeah, I'll try and get through some of the bronze coffee beans. chest we're nearly done with the oh yeah uh we're nearly done oh i should have put the osmium kelp essence that's fine i can i can live with osmium kelp essence being the only extra thing i need i have in my inventory it's fine absolutely fine so i'll sell all my jam my aged coffee done all the artisan products haven't I yeah I'm sure I have if I haven't then I can make another aged coffee I'm certain of it that's fine uh okay we're all good I think we can go to the mines now hang on I just want to check I get a double check mm. Luke and no is it Noah and Betty it's Noah and Betty isn't it yeah she had a beautiful day at the lake huh Oh, sorry. Mom, this is Shelab. You two have met, right? Shelab's the new farmer at that lot. Yes, we've met. How do you do, dear? Mom and I are doing a little stretching. I have some free time today. So, what the heck? I figured I'd bring her here. It's good to stretch. That's true. It isn't fun doing it alone. Thankfully, Noah doesn't mind keeping me company. I wish I could stay longer. I have to pick up flour from Sam's. Mom, Frank needs to hire more people. I can't be the only one running around for stuff at the tavern. He's too cheap for his own good sometimes. Son, in that case, maybe you should go do it now. If it's not making... Sorry, if it's making you anxious, I don't think you should put it off. But you'll be all alone here, Mom. No, that's a bad idea. All right, then. So I think 30 minutes more, and then we head back home. Yeah, Mom? She lab, join us. Ah. There you go. <laughs> Let's move to a different spot. Gonna go do some stretching. Right. Just want to have a little make sure that uh, I have done all of the rare artisan, which I have. So that's fine. And that coffee wasn't one of the things I needed. Yeah, I need the coffee bean. I need the... Snowdrop cactus and cotton, and then all of the rare cooking things. Well, we're going to be looking for any kind of like gemstone, you know, those little stones that have gems in them in the mine as well, because we really do need to get that red beryl. Uh, but I'm not crossing my finger. I'm not holding my breath. I'm not holding my breath. 
It's going to be a rare find. I'm going to have to do a lot of mining before I find it. So. Ah, there goes Scott. But yeah, the batteries are going to take a bit longer than I thought as well. So yeah, that's a bit of a shame, but never mind. Right, so I think probably my best bet for bat wings is the osmium shaft. Start on level five. Any bats here today? No. a bit of a double ore there. Let's go and have a look on level 15. I can't believe it's taken so long to find a bat. Well, not to find a bat, but to find these amount of bat wings. Like, it's really been bad. I found a few bats, but none of them have dropped anything. Hey, I got one. Okay. We got one. So the next one we get will be it. So even if I don't get that today, I'm actually really happy that it, I even got one because one is actually really hard to find. I've been really unlucky so far with them. Okay, so there's a gem doofer here. Let's see what's in there. A garnet, that's okay. There's another bat there. Oh, there's a couple of bats down here, nice. both fantastic so that's um an entire altar completed i'll grab this osmium and then we'll just we'll head out and go and complete it because i'm super happy about that obviously the red barrel um i don't mind spending longer finding that reason being that the rest of that altar is going to be hard to do so it's like oh well never mind but this will be a big boost. This might even boost us up enough to get the town ranked up to B. I don't know. We'll see. But it is an, it's an altar completion. A full altar completion. So I think you get a big like boost and bonus for that. I knew I'd get this one done before the catch altar. Oh no! I need to go get my other ones. <laughs> Oops. I was too excited. Okay, see. So. So let's go get the final bit of monster loot that we needed. That is wonderful. So Lake Temple. I had such terrible luck getting the bat wings and uh, I'm so happy to have them done now. My goodness. Unlocked Explosive 3. I don't know if I had that unlocked before, but... The Warp Sessor Gen Crafting Recipe. Oh, yeah. There's my explosives. What on earth is a Warp Sessor Gen? Okay. 
to see what it does. So when you use it on the temple teleporter. Oh, does it mean I can warp from anywhere? Yeah, it's like a... It's a portable warp. That I can just use... Wherever I am, I can just teleport home. Don't have to run to a teleporter. That's quite nice. That's extremely nice, actually. Like that. That's very good. Especially because it's quite uh, quite cheap. You don't have to use many flowers for that, um, many ingredients for that, which is really nice. Lovely. Um, so let me see. Garnets. They've been, yeah, they have been donated before. They're not particularly valuable, I don't think. So I think we're good to hand that one in. Uh, my explosives I can just put away with all the other explosives. My, my explosives collection. Yay! Still trying to work out the whole the whole thing. Oh man. Just trying to work out how to make these like veggie tacos and things like that. I'm hoping that maybe I'll eventually get the recipes from something. I don't know. Or I could find them or, or I could get them at the pub or I can get them as I mean, we managed to get the apple pie as a as a present, as a thing that we won at one of the festivals. I don't know though. I really don't know. We're only at 10 past 7 though, so um, what else can we do? We could go hunting for red barrel. I can go hunting for fish, but all the fish that we need for the temple are in the winter. I'm currently waiting on the batteries. Can I make another... Because these are really slow. Can I make another one? Here's the question. I think I was close to being able to. Oh yeah, no, I can. I can make another solar panel. Very nice. So let's pop that one down. Next to its friend. I don't get why that one's saying two on it and that one's saying one. It won't let me pick anything up off it. I'm very confused. Maybe it, uh, it gives you, sometimes it gives you doubles or something. I'm really not certain on that one at all. But I really want to get the um, the catching and then the first the catching and then the other component the uh, the critter component. So the fish catching and then the critter catching. I have a lot of money right now. Shall we tomorrow? I'm going to do one more day. I think I'm just going to. I'm kind of done with everything I wanted to do there. But I don't think I've got time to really do much, like, sea clearing or anything like that, so... I'm just gonna go to bed there. So I've now got combat level 4, I've got a spring trap and monster scent. Which is nice, we made 10,000. Which is also quite nice. Like, the money we're making is just off the charts right now. Like, I I'm at a point where I'm like, I don't really need all this money, but I do because there's decorations that I want to buy and there's things I want to do to decorate the house and make things nice. So I wanted to make sashimi for Raphael, didn't I? So I'm kind of thinking I might actually want to do a little bit of fishing so that I can make the fish into sashimi. 
So let's go and see what I find over here. Because I'm kind of now starting to think about my social stuff. There's also a lot of upgrading I still need to do. Actually quite a quite a wiggly worm, aren't you? Salmon. I'll happily catch a few salmon and make them into sashimi. If I just make two or three right now, I think that should make me about enough for about a week. I think you get two per. But the only thing that, are, that is a problem is uh, the amount of wasabi I've got. Ooh, a sockeye as well. Pretty sure I've um, got the sockeye and the salmon in the museum already. I'm looking forward to having information on the sorts of things that I do and don't have. So I think crayfish, sockeye salmon, and salmon are already donated. Sockeye salmon should be, unless it's all still sat in my chest. Maybe I need to take things over to the museum, actually. Yeah, I've got a sockeye salmon just like sat there waiting, so... That's fine. I'm just going to pop these fish into the fridge and we'll make a little bit of sashimi out of them. So let's use a sockeye salmon and some wasabi. Another sockeye salmon, another wasabi. So that's four. Uh, let's make six. Right then. There are other people that I might want to make friends with and things, but I don't know. Also, upgrading the house is another thing I would I would want to do. Uh, right. Hmm. Looks like the battery might have gotten stuck, or it's it's either gotten stuck or it's. There's one there that came out. Which means I got four. Okay. So it's starting on a second one now, but uh, what a nightmare. Just cranberries today, so that's getting a little bit more manageable. Uh, the honey is ready. Animals can be let out. Maple syrup. Collect the eggs. Only one egg today, that's fine. No, two golden eggs. Oh no, that's like four minis. Okay, that's fine. We can cope with that. Uh, there's wool to collect today. And there's cow milk. And there's goat milk. And how is Penelope doing for affection? Ah, okay, Penelope's at full affection now, so that's fine. Let's go and see how Phoenix is doing. Phoenix is at seven, okay. Can I shake this tree yet? I can. That was annoying me for a while. Okay, got some apples today. Still don't know how to make apple pie. Don't need to know now, but maybe one day I'll learn. 
put all the fruit away. Oh no, the fruit doesn't fit. What? I should make some jam or something. And I'll make some dragon fruit jam. I knew I was going to do that. Okay, well, that's at least used up all the... Well, some of the dragon fruit, anyway. Take the coffee. Might make a different kind of juice today, maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Um... How about we make some grape juice? We can make proper wine. Oh, apparently we're making grape jam as well. Oh, well, it doesn't hurt, right? <laughs> wool today I did and cheese and mayonnaise and milk for goat's cheese and I've got scavenger balls to pick up as well today Put my osmium kelp essence back because that's been in the way for a while as well. We'll put the grapes back in the fruit thing because we didn't quite use them all. And then was there anything else I needed to do? No. Okay. Going to take the coffers and the geodes and things over to the blacksmiths and see if I can find Raphael while we're at it. He should be around there somewhere. Yeah, I just don't seem to want to do anything with that. It's weird. Okay. Let's go sell. I could add that goat cheese. No, there's, it's only normal cheese. Normal cheese I just tend to sell because... Uh, the, I don't have that many aging barrels at the moment. When I have more aging barrels, obviously, it's going to be a bit easier. We'll make a lot of kimchi. We'll make a lot of just everything that we need. I should put that sword away. I don't need it. It's taking up an inventory slot that I shouldn't be taking. And let's go for donations. I'm actually going to put my osmium ore in here because I'm being a bit lazy. And what we're going to do is take all the geodes and coffers over to get opened up in fact I'm going to put my coffee in there as well I'll pick it up when I come back for the other things got a lot of things that have already been donated and offered and stuff haven't I um and then I could actually take the fossils over no let's just one thing at a time at the moment The thing is, by the time I got this um, warp Sessajan thing, by the time I got that... Oh, what's going on here? Oh, it's Karen! What can I get you today, Miss Pufferfish? Karen is fine, Mr. Sanchez. I'm here to announce my candidacy for the upcoming mayoral election. Mayoral election? We have that? I thought Mayor Connor is the mayor. He is for now, but that's mostly because he's been running unopposed. Right, right. We had that meeting a few years back where we said that Mayor Connor will still be mayor. So you want to be mayor of this small town? Why? I see the potential in this town. Like you, for example. 
You and your brother are extremely talented blacksmiths, but I can't help but notice all your tools are obsolete. There are machines out there that can make your production time much shorter. In turn, you'll have more fun to enjoy the small town life. I can do that and more if you vote for me as mayor of Starlet Town. Why don't you read this pamphlet? I'm sure it'll be of interest to you. I look forward to your vote in the upcoming election. Okay, well, the Sanchez brothers did not tell her to get out, so that was nice of them. Well, hello there, farmer. Don't worry, I'll talk to you soon. I want your vote too. I think Raphael might have told them where to go, but... Uh, what are you reading? Miss Puffish Fish wants to be mayor. This is her pamphlet. But Mayor Connor is mayor. <laughs> That's what I said. Do you know what this is all about, Sheila? It's plan M. <laughs> huh? Well, let's deal with that later. How can I help you, Sheila? Well, I would like to open all of these coffers and see if any of them are not duplicates. And I also would like to give Mr. Raphael a present. Upgrading a tool, Sheila? Thank you for the... Sashimi Shilab. Oh, uh, the Shilab Sashimi. Oops, I mean, never mind. You know what I mean. He's so cute. He is adorable. Right, so processed geodes or coppers. So that's water, water geodes, bronze ore. Fire geodes, coal. Earth geode, marble. Well, ornate coffer. Gold earring. I think we've had that before. Carved ring holder, glass, that's what it's called, silver kelp, bronze kelp, a green mask, that might be new, you know, it probably isn't, but it might be, I don't recognise it, pearl brooch I don't recognise, snow globe I do, trash, gold kelp, scrap, glass, mysterious coffers, moonlight earrings, Crash. Town model. Wouldn't have. I'm sure people told me that the town model I hasn't handed in at one point. So whether I have in the meantime since, I don't know. Glass bowl. I think we had bronze statue before. Underwater tablet might be new. I'm getting a lot of glass though, so I might be able to make another silver port. I might be able to make another um, solar panel. I don't know how many I'm going to actually need. The Batik Shawl, I'm sure that that's one I haven't had before. Oh man. Alright then, let's go to the museum. We can always come back. Kind of amused me that it was she lab sashimi. <laughs> I kind of understand like how with the name like she lab and sashimi that you would get those like confused as well. I think it wouldn't have worked as well with a different name. Donate item. So we got a stone hand axe. That was a new one. The town model was a new one. The glass bowl was a new one. The pearl brooch was a new one. The bronze statue was a new one. And the batik shawl was a new one. We got had loads of them. Wow, those pirate coffers. Right, let's open the last four and just see what's in them. I actually want to see as well. Um, no, it's fine, I'll just go back to there. I want to see how close we are to the town upgrade now. Like... Really? We're like 10, 9 points away. Three donations to the museum away. If that's how it works. Which I think it might be. Okay, so process geode or coffer. Let's try and see if there's anything new in these last 
four boxes. But there is not. It's fine. So I'll probably be able to get the town to rank B using the computer. I would imagine. Because getting to catch new things and knowing where to go for it. It's going to be really, really important. But yeah, we're so close. Uh, if I can get the town to town to, to like B rank, that's going to be really, really good. Kind of upset with these solar panels, though. They seem to be not working so well for me for some reason. Right, I've got all of these um, artifacts, but I feel like probably I want to sell most of them. I can always go down to the caves to get more, can't I? Then I'll put away any building materials that I happen to have gotten and then we'll go into the shed and put the rest of the stuff away. Oh, my mayonnaise machine. <laughs> we might be able to make that now. Yay! I had loads of stuff in a chest that I shouldn't have had things in as well. In fact, let's just to save a tiny bit of time. What I want to do is head over to Hillside and I want to have a look in the carpenter's shop. Because I want to know what I need to build a stable. But I want a horse. I've got all this money. I should have a horse, right? And another upgraded house. So my next house upgrade is 40,000 coins, which is easy. 10 silver bar, 150 stone and 200 wood. That should be really easy to do. Um, for my stable, I need 15,000. I need five silver bars, 50 scrap and 200 stone. I might not have 200 stone. I've definitely got 50 scrap. Five silver bars I could probably go and get. Right. Scrap, stone, silver. I think I had nine silver pieces, so I need to get more, I think. Because I'll need 50. I will need 50 silver pieces. Let me see. Uh, oh no, I've got three. So I need like 47 more. Okay, fine. Guess where we're spending the evening then? I don't even know whether I'll use the horse that much. Probably just use loads of fast travel points, but I just want to have one <laughs> at this point. I do also really want to have an osmium um, fishing rod, though that's going to be kind of important to have by... I would say I want that by the end of fall. So we've got a little bit of time, but still. Okay. If we're wanting silver, that is water cavern. Go down to level 15. So we're really at the moment looking for any kind of gems. If we happen to find a gem, we're not needing to really do any combat particularly. We can if we want to upgrade our skills. Uh, but we're just kind of mostly looking for silver ores and I want to get 47 of them. So that is 12 out of my 47, so that's now 35. Lovely. Um, I will jump down the hole and see if there's anything down there. I 
The only problem with that is then I need to come back out and back in, but there, there is nothing of any value in this area, unfortunately. Boo! I'm a bit sad as well that we never... Oh, I didn't want to completely exit the mines. Oops. Um, I am a bit sad that we never got the batteries running, but they I, I think they are getting stuck a bit with that little sort of sticky bug that you get. And so I'm one short, which is, again, a bit frustrating. But the next time we log on, I expect there'll be a loser batteries to pick up, which will be wonderful. And then I'll be able to go and sort that out. So we are on 15 of the 47 I need. Okay. start hang on we only need 25 I do this all the time I think we need 10 but we don't we need five So I need to get to 25. We have 18. So I need like another seven or something. For the house upgrade, which needs 10 silver bars, then we will need that, but not for the stable, which is the one I'm going to do first. Oh, that's just cheating. Beating me up while I've still got Still got my pickaxe out. It sucks. How dare they? Come here, wasps. No silver here at all. Wow. Gotta love that. So, so far, out of all the monster loot, the only like stuff I've managed. Oh, there it is. I ran straight past it. Too busy. Ah, may as well. If I get more, then I get more. It's just less I have to find for the house upgrade then. There's some. Get out my way. Okay, so we've got 34 silver ore. And in total, to get both the stable and the house upgrade, I'll need like about 70 odd. So we'll have to come back down here again. But for now, I think we're absolutely fine. Very, very happy with what we got done today. Getting my mermaid tail getting the computer up and running, uh, doing a little bit of decorating using the computer. I will do more of that. I'll get more grass, definitely. That grass is amazing, it's lovely. So pretty. I'll probably get something nice to put in between the, um, like a nice paving or something to put in between here. It's so much nicer than the stuff I can craft on my own, so. Right then, time to go to bed and end the episode there, I think. And um, yeah, we've got like loads of money, so we can definitely do all the upgrades I want. Um, we'll probably, going into year three, be aiming to have all osmium tools. I've got them mostly up to gold at this point. Um, and then like when I have extra money and extra stuff and extra time, I'll maybe do the watering can and I'll maybe sort out the hoe to high levels but I don't really need it that much anyway that's it for today so let's go to bed and see if anything happens in the night just in case it does so mining got up to level nine so I can now make the explosive threes I made ten thousand we didn't get a heart with Raphael though for giving him the sashimi which is sad but we recently got a heart with him at the festival so if we have a quick look here I think he's already on like five out of the eight hearts we need. And um, 
Yeah, I've given him a gift. Oh, actually, I think as well, it's gifts for the week, isn't it? So I'll need to start just going around and giving everybody their gifts. I can see how many people I didn't manage to give a gift to, like at the Harvest Festival. I didn't have enough coffee for everyone, but that's fine. Anyway, that is going to be it for today. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, then please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. Hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.